Hello world, Calc Programmer one here. Just a quick little video on something I'm working on. This is my idea for a, an RGB desk fan. I was kind of inspired by that Noctua desk fan. If you haven't seen it, look it up. Um, basically just a PC fan in a stand that plugs in externally, but I wanted to make one that's RGB. So inside this box is an Arduino Pro Micro running Corsair Lighting Protocol, a customized version that I made. Uh, it controls a PWM fan. It's powered by 12 volts and it connects via USB. And I'm working on the idea of being able to adjust the fan speed using a knob. And so like, I have an LED strip in the base, and so right now the fan speed is at minimum, which means the PWM is all the way down. Uh, the fan still spins even at 0% PWM. I might fix that with like a MOSFET, haven't decided yet. And then you can turn the knob to adjust the fan speed all the way up. Now it's at full speed. Um, so, and then after five seconds, it times out and it goes back to whatever effect it's running. Currently, it is being controlled by OpenRGB, uh, running an effect. So if I look inside the box, we've got an Arduino Pro Micro. This is running two channels of ARGB, one for the fan and one for the LED strip that's inside. And then we've got the fan itself, which is powered by 12 volts, and the PWM is powered by the Arduino. And then we have a step-down converter that takes the 12 volts, turns it down to 5 volts uh, to run the RGB. Um, and so far, that's all I've got. I want to be able to make it so that clicking in on the knob uh, turns the fan on and off. Um, and then the fan speed is also controllable in software because it's a Corsair Lighting Node Pro. It's, it's using the Corsair protocol. I need to make it so that the knob can override the fan speed, but then the software can still control it. I haven't got that all figured out yet. Um, and then, yeah, I just want to print a frame to hold the fan. Uh, I've already done that on another version I test printed. This is a base box that I modeled up in Blender uh, with screw holes to mount the uh, proto boards that I've set everything up on. And when it's all finished, I want to uh, publish the designs on Thingiverse and on uh, GitLab. So yeah, just a little project overview video. Uh, thanks for watching.